Have you ever heard the phrase, this food tastes so good it makes you want to slap your mama? Well, guess what? Look out, mama. $20,000 to slap the hell out of their mother. Oh, no, hell no. I ain't slapping my mama. Okay, I'll tell you what. How about this? 50. I'll do it. Say no more. See you later. Okay, wait. guys, we're going to go. Follow us. Let's this guy's going to slap his mama. Nah, I might buy a new car. She's going to be mad till her face stops stinging. Everybody, I'll take it to the Mama! Mama, forgive me. Oh my God! Oh, what? What? Oh, my God. Get the heck out of my yard! Go, go, get in the car! Go, 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 go! Get him, get him, get him, get him! People will steal from their mother. You got fifty thousand dollars, baby. Fifty thousand. Yeah, but your mama won't be mad at him not. For the love of money, baby. He slapped his mama, and I don't know where he's going, no, how he's going to get to eat tonight. But brother, you got $50,000. Open up. I'll tell you what. Fifty freaking thousand dollars. How much would I got to eat? You ain't got to get four, just a little bit. You got to tell us something when I'm done, or? No, you your shirt. Nigga, you're going to have fifty thousand dollars. Come on, let's go. Fifty. I, I, I don't know. That's why. Yeah. Man, I'll take your money. Oh my god, get it. he's nasty. People will do anything. This nasty nigga, let's go. <laughs> Yo, so those two videos y'all just got done seeing. The first video, my man offers him 50 G's to slap his mama. Now, me personally, I wouldn't do that. I ain't that hurt for money. I'm not slapping my mama. And even though my mom has done some stuff that I don't personally and particularly like, I let bygones be bygones. I ain't hit my mom. I've never hit my mom. I, she'll tell you that I grabbed her. That was some bullshit. I moved her the fuck out my way and jumped out a window. I didn't hit her though. I, I will never hit my mom because I got respect. There's something that a lot of you broke ass niggas and bitches don't. I ain't mad at Frankie Nunez or what the fuck is that nigga name? Joanna Man. I don't know his name off the rip, right? But I ain't mad at him. Miguel Nunez, that's what his name is. I'm not mad at Miguel Nunez. Now, he's done another iteration of punked, right? This ain't nothing, but first it was Red Man and Met the Man with Stung or some something was like a punk type TV show. Then you had Ashton Kutcher with Punk. And now you got a show with him. I don't know exactly what the hell. What would you do for, for the love of money? I think that's what it's called. Yeah, I'm not slapping my mom. These Some people just hard up, though. Like, they would actually do that. They got no respect. This new generation is just retarded. And in the second video, my man paid him 50 grand to eat some dookie off the ground. Dog dookie. Now, I don't know what you got to be going through mentally, spiritually, and physically to eat dog dookie. All I'm going to say is, I ain't that hurt either. Like, I, I need money. I really do. I need money like everybody in this world need money. However, there's a certain things that I'm not doing. And it probably goes in this order. Slapping my mama, doing gay stuff, and eating feces i'm cool I i'll figure it out i think that's what the new generation's problem is they need to start figuring it out right they want to take the easy shortcuts that's probably why our society is collapsing because people just want things easy and it's the saying that anything that's easy ain't worth having right you know when people offer you something free is, is usually something you don't really need or really want or not of good quality Go out there and get a hustle, a skill, bring more value to the marketplace, and only then can you see your fruits of your labors. But trying to go out there, like, my, the residuals from slapping your mom, that's going to harm a relationship. Unless you don't care about that, then there's that. Or eating dog dookie. The, the residual effects from that is, bro, you can have a parasitic disease, a life-threatening disease. Like, you can, like, act, bacterial infection, all types of stuff. Like, what do they say? For every action is an equal yet opposite reaction. Like, yeah, you got 50 grand and that feel good, but you could mess around and get a parasitic disease, a blood-borne pathogen, a bacterial infection, and then you could die, which is equal to, like, extreme as having joy for getting 50 grand. People need to start putting more consideration and thought and critical thinking into this what they doing. Unless all this stuff is staged, then it's entertaining. It was funny as hell to watch. I ain't gonna hold you. In any event, if you like this episode, YouTube, I did not cuss. Please do not mess with my videos, right? Y'all don't mess with Mr. Beast, bro. Leave me alone. If you like this episode, subscribe, turn the notifications on, like, comment, and share. Leave a comment. I'm trying to see what y'all temperature is. And I'm out. No.